A Tennessee boy's tragic story of bullying is shining a light on a problem that impacts millions of students every year. His story is gaining millions of new friends from his hometown to Hollywood. WJC's Live Jonathan McCall has more on the support he's now receiving. Jonathan. Vic, so far, 20 million people have watched the emotional trauma and painstaking toll that bullying has taken on Keaton Jones. His mom says that she posted the video after she says her son was too afraid to even go to lunch at school. Just out of curiosity, it's a question. Why do they bully? Millions What's of victims ask they every day. They make fun of my nose. They call me ugly. They say I have no friends. With no real answers. People that are different. Don't need to be criticized about it. Meet Keaton Jones, one of the more than three million American students bullied in schools every single year. His agonizing cries and tear soaked pleas to make the torment stop has now been viewed more than 20 million times. Keaton's mom posted this video after picking him up from school because she says that he was too afraid to go to lunch. What did they do to you at lunch? Put milk on me and put ham down my clothes. But in the face of all the pain, Keaton is actually making plenty of new friends in his hometown. I don't believe anybody should go through what he went through at all. I'd be upset. I, I think that would be hurtful. And in Hollywood. This kid is all time. He's a legend. Go check him out. His name's Keaton. Several celebrities taking to social media to stand with him. Actor Mark Ruffalo calling him one of the coolest kids he's ever seen. Actress Haley Steinfeld. I would love for you, Keaton Jones, to be my date to the Pitch Perfect 3 premiere on Tuesday. Avengers star Chris Evans even encouraging Keaton to stay strong and promised it would get better. Words Keaton are now taking to heart. Don't let it bother you. Stay strong, I guess. Hard. But it'll probably get better one day. It definitely will get better for Keaton one day. We did get a chance to hear from Keaton's principal today who says that the incident mentioned in the video was something that was resolved weeks ago, but he had not heard of anything happening afterwards. The principal today also says that he plans to have a message of anti-bullying for the students at Keaton School. We're live tonight. I'm Jonathan McCall reporting for WJZ. Jonathan, thank you. A GoFundMe page set up for Keaton has already raised nearly $60,000.